Hey everybody, and welcome back. So in the last part, we left off with a rather, um, well, a bit of a cliffhanger, I guess you could say. And, um, yeah, well, we were in Guama, basically. Uh, start of a new chapter, fairly short chapter, as you all probably are well aware. Uh, so we'll jump into that now. It's been a few days um, since I played this last, so I'm going to have to try and get into it again, which is fine, because if I remember correctly, this is pretty much of a, it's kind of like a slow sort of pace to this bit. Uh, if you could leave a like, a comment, and subscribe, that would be great, but I'm not going to delay you any further. Let's jump straight in. Guarma. Uh, oh, I forgot there's a loading screen. I should have hit this a bit sooner. This is pretty much the motif that Rockstar goes for now, isn't it? The sort of pictures in the loading screen. Like, GTA has a variation on this. But obviously with, like, more abstract art, this is more pictures. Like, photogra like photographs and slightly burnt around the edges. Which is cool. F definitely fits the game. Now, we just need to... Wait for... There's a thing, because there's no loading. Like, loading bar. At least GTA has like a loading thing. In the corner, percentage. There we go. Okay, this only jumps in at 50%, it seems. What else did I do in the walkthrough? Uh, I... Got the Lamat Revolvers. Which I'm very happy for. Um, I'm calling them Ebony and Pearl. Again, like I called the Schofield revolvers. Ah, there we go. Okay, so it started off... Cool. This is basically where I left off, so it's all good. Come on! How is his beard growing so quickly, but his hair isn't? Is that just me? Where the hell am I? I should really put the volume down on my head, like on the earphones, pretty soon. Probably in the next part. If I try and do it now, it'll just mess up the recording. But yeah, the music is deafening at this point. Love, love background music. Uh, when I first played this, I was wondering if this was going to be how the game ends. Just Arthur wandering around aimlessly on a deserted beach. Like a deserted island. I was like, where are we? No. Oh god, the music in this is so loud. Bear in mind, I do have, like, I'm not wearing a regular headset, I am wearing, uh, earphones, so, yeah. And dead.
Go Arma. Ah, cool. Yeah. Signs. There's life. I'm not on my own. But I can't, I can't move Arthur. I'm gonna just move him forward. Good. 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 Boys. You're alive. Arthur. Oh boy, that's it. You're, you're alive. <laughs> Arthur. You're okay. It is a miracle. It is a goddamn miracle. Here, have, have something to drink. <laughs> have a drink. Somebody yeah. give him a goddamn drink. Oh, son. Son, take it easy. Oh, we got you. We got you. <laughs> so... Where the hell are we? We are on the island of Guarma. Javier asked the local. It's a old sugar plantation island. Second island east of Cuba. Is it anywhere near Australia or Tahiti? It's on the way, I guess. So, what next? I don't know. <laughs> Well, next I guess we're gonna get shot. Encadenen a estos hombres! Gentlemen, this is quite a welcome. Who are you? Senor, por favor. We are no one. What's your name? Aiden O'Malley. Is that so? What are you doing, Mr. O'Malley? Surviving. We were lost at sea. In the storm. Is that so? No. I'm in the habit of looking like this. Is all of this really necessary? We got enough troubles around here right now, Mr. O'Malley, without taking a chance on a bunch of vagabonds. Behave yourselves and no harm will befall you. Vamos! 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 Let's go! Yep, this got looks good. Group rounded up down the way. Yeah, this looks like it's gonna... Turn out well first. I don't get your drift, Mr. Uh... Levi Simon, senior overseer for Alberto Fusar. We run the third most productive sugar plantation in the Northern Caribbean. Of course, where there's money to be made, there's trouble. What sort of trouble? No, oh, the usual sort. People wanting what ain't theirs and others telling them to take it. I don't get you. Labor troubles. And other thieves and pirates looking to disrupt our ways of working. How very upsetting for you. Not half as upsetting as it'll be for them. Mr. Fusar has a lot of very powerful friends. I will bet that he does. Bunch of Haitian pirates won't frighten him. They'll be strung up in the streets soon enough. And do we seem like Haitian pirates to you, Mr. Simon? seem like someone or other. We was headed to Tahiti. You was going to scenic route. Just as soon as I know exactly who you are, you'll be free. In the meantime, you'll not starve. Cabo, llévese a estos hombres a la carsa, junto con el grupo de cucarachas de ese campesino. Cualquier tontería que hagan, dispárales a todos. Welcome to Guama, gentlemen. Now, if you'll excuse me. Yeah! What now, Aiden? I don't know. What do you think? I think we've got to get out of here. Yeah, but they can't find out who we are. Well, for now, we're stuck, Ben. Well, 
For what it's worth, I think I would have preferred Tahiti. You and me both. Yep. I can see why. The tropical cl uh, climate isn't really my choice, either. Especially when there's armed guards everywhere. Who are these people? Who knows? Well, they got them chained and lashed, but they don't look too dangerous. Excuse me, sir. Who are our new friends here? <laughs> Criminales. What crime did they commit? Insurrección. <laughs> Insurrection. That's quite a word. Cállate, señor Fuentes. Vuelvanse. Todos. There's not much, like, give in this chain. <laughs> Look how close they have to be to Dutch. There you go. So it doesn't look like I'm trying to dry hump him. Couldn't have happened to a nicer guy. Enforcements. We need to get out of here. Now we're in trouble. Come on, come on, David. Everyone, follow me. Please, David. Come, come, come. Uh, 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 get out of here. Get out of here. There's a lot of them. Uh, what do you think? We gotta move, Dutch. Go. Don't lose face, son. We'll find you. Cooey, cooey. Go, go. <laughs> I hit bolt action rifle. What are you doing here? I have no idea. Running from somebody or something, I guess. 
How went we all? Hercule Fontaine. Dutch Vanderlyn. These drowned rats are Micah, Bill, and Arthur. Okay. Well, Fusa will be desperate to find you. We must be very careful. So, who is this Fusor? A tyrant, driven by nothing but power and greed. Our only purpose is to work ourselves to death to make him rich. Leon wants the people to stand up to Fusa, but most are too afraid. And you? I am not from here. I bring things in and off the islands behind Colonel Fusa's back. And Fusa is the guy from let's, the mayor's uh, party. Let's rest a moment. Down there is Aqua Dolce, Fusa's compound. The sugar cane these poor men kill themselves farming gets processed in that factory there. They're little more than slaves shipped in from other islands. A group escaped yesterday into the jungle hoping to find a way back to their homes. Now Fusa's men are out hunting them down. That old fort? Cinco Torres. My men and I use that as a hideout when we are here. Come on. I know somewhere you men can rest. Can we trust you? I don't see you have any choice. I am the only one who can arrange a boat for you. But I need something in return. Help Leon with that group of escaped workers and then come meet me at the fort. Could you help us get back our friend and get out of here? We will do everything we can. Thank you. Gracias. If your friend is still alive, they will have him at Fusa's compound. There is a cave hidden below the cliffs. It will lead you right there. Thank you. The workers are somewhere in the jungle. Hopefully we can get to them before Fusa does. Of course. Gentlemen. Well? Goodbye. If this is a tropical paradise, so far it ain't up to much. I'll go scope the entrance to that cave. Arthur. I need to get some rest. Well, you're right. We all need to relax. <clears throat> what a mess. I... I'm so sorry, boys. Get some sleep, Dutch. Micah, guard this spot. Bill, uh, do some more scouting carefully. the question mark first maybe which one's which one's closer let's check nope that's not what i wanted uh which one's, okay yeah the question mark's closer so let's do that and then we'll go and meet dutch oh shit well that's one way to get down a slope i guess fling yourself over the edge Fine, Arthur. Just work your way through it. Okay, uh, at least he didn't fall off the cliff. That would have been embarrassing. I'd be like, I don't speak your language. Who are you? Who are you? Who are you? Where are you from? Where are you from? Where are you from? Where are you from? I'm asking you. What are you doing here? 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 Come on. I'm an American. My name is Leviticus Cornwall. ¿Quién es este hombre? No lo había visto antes. Me estaba siguiendo en el bosque. Un tipo raro. 
Okay, let's escape. Come on. Come on, Arthur. Put that... Put that mighty intelligence to work. to the other workers. Uh, oh yeah. Uh, I think I hear voices coming from the other ruins down there. Let's sneak down and take a look. Which way? I'll show you. Baptiste, you don't look good. You should rest here. Okay. You'll need this. Go. Go. Come. Follow me. Stay close behind me. I know a way we can sneak around. Okay. Keep quiet and don't kill anyone. If they catch us, they'll murder the workers for sure. Who was that, Phil? Shh. One of Hercule's men. Poirot? Hercule Poirot? Quick! Hide. Oye, Over there. Pasa? Pedro, it's una cosa. Mi abuelo siempre dijo que la Guarma era la isla de la que ellos se había olvidado. Y después de estar aquí un mes, entiendo a lo que se refería. No hay nada aquí. Hay que regresar. Tan solo tres meses más y a casa. Por favor. Ok. They moved. Come on. Keep close behind me. This man has a masterful grip of the obvious. Ah, look at that. They've walked away. Follow me. Let's go. What will I ever do without him? The guard! Keep out of sight! Two more ahead. Take cover on the other side of this. How, how are they not hearing you? Like we are shouting. <laughs> Two more ahead. It's like yeah, they're also deaf, so we're fine. ¿Qué tal va todo para allá? Ya casi acabo. Out of the way. Saben. Por mucho que disfruto viendo un socialista colgando, ahorcar es un trabajo tedioso, ¿ah? ¿eh? Toma demasiado tiempo. Estás enfermo. Toca ver cómo sigan los prisioneros. A ver si el gringo ya abrió la boca. Claro que abrió la boca. Siempre lo hacen. So we're doing pretty well. Granted, this guy's given all the orders, so I'm just following him, but he's doing pretty well. Okay, let's move. Maldito bastardo! Get them down from there! Shoot the ropes! Okay, here comes the... Here comes backup.
Ah, I missed. Thank you, my friend. I'm Baptiste. I work with El Kud. We owe you our lives. Yes, thank you. My pleasure. This place makes me miss home. Take care, my friend. Hercule is getting a boat lined up to get you and your men out of here. Just meet him at Cinco Torres. We'll be there. Good, good. Here, this is for you. Thanks. It's not much, but it's the least we can do. Good luck getting home. What a nice group of guys. Okay, well, now that we've done that mission, let's uh, go and meet Dirch. I, I'm gonna fall flat on my face again any time now. This terrain just sucks. Okay, so this is probably the only bit of mountain climbing we can actually do in this game. Most of the terrain isn't really designed for this. Hey! Hey! So, uh... What's the plan? Well, I found the cave Hercule spoke of, and also a guide. She's up ahead. I think we can trust her. Follow me. The entrance is along here. Just watch your footing. Uh, Dutch has proven to be a brilliant judge of character, so let's trust him. So, uh, what do we do when we get Javier? Well, right? uh, we're gonna get the hell out of here, man. Set sail for the one place. Ain't nobody gonna be expecting us. Uh, uh, get everybody together uh, and get ourselves back on course. Where would that be? place we just escaped from. <laughs> you want to go back to San Denis? If it was you got left, you'd want us to go back. I'd want it, but I wouldn't expect That's it. That's the point. Ain't no one gonna expect it. We come back from the dead, gather everyone, and we leave before anyone realizes we've even resurrected. An insect bite you or something? Cause you gone, friend. We... Look like what we are. A bunch of desperado on the run. But with the women, a change of clothes, <laughs> we're a choir or a gang of pilgrims or something. Whatever you say. A bunch of penniless fugitives on some Caribbean dump, sneaking through caves while two of our best men got shot back home. How could I doubt you, Dutch? You got no idea, Arthur. No idea at all. I will do. Whatever it takes for us to survive. I guess that's what I'm afraid of. Hold on. Why? Gloria! Ay, estás tarde. Buenas noches. Buenas noches. Dinero, the money, the gold. Aquí. Dámelo. Oh, it's genuine, you old hag. How could she tell by smelling it? Vamos. Vamos. Is that a thing? Rápido. Is that a thing I'm not aware of? There. This last bit of gold smelling I have gold. In my from the bank. The rest of it is at the bottom of the sea. Exactly. Follow Gloria through the cave. 
Caves. Caves. You know, wasn't Fusar one of the fellas Bronte pointed out to us at the party at Saint Denis? Yeah. You're right. I knew I'd heard that name before. Yeah. So, I met up with Leon. That situation with the workers is dealt with. Captured, tied up, beaten. Poor bastards. No, that was me. Are you sure this her Q fellers ain't just using us? Almost certainly. But he's the best chance we have right now of getting out of this place. Won't be long before someone figures out who we are and sends word to the U.S. So what happened with John in that bank? He survived. Unlike dear Hosea and Lenny. The only one they took alive. Why is that, you think? I don't know. I was already on the roof. I didn't see it. And Abigail, I presume she was able to slip away in time. What are you talking about? You know, when I look back at all the chaos of the past few weeks, the apparent superficial chaos, I begin to wonder, maybe, for somebody, this is all going exactly to plan. I still ain't sure what you're saying, Dutch. The door is stuck. You'll have to lift it. Pardon me, my queen. <clears throat> Arthur, come help me with this. Just lift it. Okay, then. Just a, just a bit more. <laughs> oh, this way. See, si. then you pay more. Okay. More. Just a second. Pay more. Pay now. What? What are you doing? Oh, Jesus. Easy, Dutch. What was that? Horrible old crone. But you killed her. She was going to betray us, Arthur. Couldn't you tell? No. Well, I got some Spanish. She was. You sure you're all right, Dutch? I am just trying to make sure that some of us survive, Arthur. Now, shall we proceed? I guess. Listen, <clears throat> son. You think I want any of this? I don't know. Of course I don't. But I made a pledge to you all. We would survive, no matter what. So how did you know she was going to betray us? What'd she say? It was in her eyes, in the way she was leading us. But you said you knew Spanish. I know human beings, Arthur. Well, maybe we've all just gone rotten. I'm doing the best I can. <laughs> but my friend, I do not understand. Who are you? I come from Mexico. I never met those men. Does anyone believe him? <laughs> Mr. Simon doesn't believe you. Even the mule doesn't believe you. Eso ni fue para tanto. Sí que deja de actuar. Sabemos que no estuvo tan fuerte. Fue bastante duro. No. La próxima vez será aún más duro. Bueno. Ha sido un placer. Siempre me encantaron. Los mexicanos. Vamos, carajo. They're all listening to that football. They won't notice us if we stay quiet. We need to deal with them. Well, I'm sure you got some ideas. Shut up and help me kill them. On my
my count. You take the one on the right. I'll take the left. Sure thing, Dutch. So much for the count to three. Okay, let's hide the bodies. You grab that one. Over here. Well, oh, not that. Oh, actually, no, that doesn't go down very far, does it? Never mind. I was going to say down the well. well. Let's head around the back of the building and see if we can find a way through. Let's go in there. Ah. Uh, well, you know me, Arthur will cause ourselves a little distraction and then poof, we will disappear. You first. Take the other side of this door. Ni es una civilización, un país civilizado. Me podría costar mujeres que usan zapatos. Tienes algo de tomar? ¿Cómo sabías? Porque te conozco. Sí, escondí una botella. Voy a buscarla. Gracias. Okay, you take the nearest one on the left. I'll deal with his friend. Es una mierda. Es lo más bajo de una civilización. Over here. Why are you walking so slow, Arthur? Come on, put some spring in your step. Uh. Okay. Now we need to create a diversion. Uh, what do you think? Find another old lady to strangle? That is enough, Arthur. This is a war. Well, if this is a war, then we need to start blowing some stuff up. <laughs> exactly. Is there any dynamite? Oh no, we don't need dynamite. We got a furnace. And lots of sugar. Sugar? Oh yeah. <laughs> no problem. You'll see. <laughs> Go close the windows and the doors. Go on, quick! Red enough duck. This place will go. Okay. We are nearly there. Uh, I suppose I need to open up another bag of sugar. I guess. I mean, he didn't. He didn't tell me to do it. He just said, like, you know, open up or close the windows. But okay. Uh, regroup with the. So these guys are about to find out the dangers of making sugar. For me, I'll get this going. We better hurry. Follow me. Okay. I was just over there, Dutch. Why didn't you just follow me? Yeah, egotistical bastard. I don't want to be too close to that building when it goes up. Come on, we can hide behind that well. That place has to blow soon. Get ready to make a run for Javier. Now, let's go. Oh, my glad to see you. 
Have they started shooting? Great. I'm stuck here. Hey. Ah. Wait. Then move. Let him. Okay, I shot enough now. Let's uh, go find Dutch. Oh well, he's just hobbling along at his own pace. It's like I said, Fusar knows who you are and knows the price on your head. It's a big problem. Uh, I see. But if we can silence him, then I can help you escape before anyone has time to get here from America. That way, we all get what we want. 
We want to get the boat you promised us. And you will. But you have found yourself in the middle of a war, my friend. Fuso has called in the Navy from Cuba. There's no way a boat could leave right now. Hercule! Hercule, s'il vous plaît! Vite! Vite! Come. Follow me. Quick! Okay, I'm gonna have to call it quits here because I'm running up to, like, my deadline for the recording. Um... Hope you all enjoyed the walkthrough, hope you all enjoyed the commentary and so on and so forth. If you could leave a like, leave a comment down below and hit that subscribe button, I would be greatly uh, appreciative, appreciative, or whatever, uh, of it. Uh, it's like two o'clock in the morning, all right. <laughs> I, I'm not going to pronounce every word spot on. Um, yeah, that would be great. And yeah, wait for the end screen and you know, you know the deal. See you next time and do take care. Ta-da.